the training will also at the same time improve the person who is going to undertake and participate in the training, but also open up their mind as far as opportunities are concerned. This may lead to improved uh, chances and exposure as far as technical knowledge is concerned. As I know that many talented young people in Uganda are looking for good jobs. Meanwhile, many companies find it hard to find qualified and trained employees. Wuhan City Polytechnic and the CCCC are the pioneers for training smart and capable Ugandans to compete for those jobs. The 32 trainees here today are known as the outstanding representatives of the youth of Uganda, leading the way for the future of Uganda. It can be said that your dreams are the Ugandan dreams. We believe you all will become the driving forces to expedite Ugandan development. The need for skilled labor has never been more pronounced. This program not only equips participants with technical expertise, but also cultivates mindset of innovation, adaptab adaptability, and lifelong learning. I think especially the skill transfer is a priority, more and more priority of our bilateral relationship. Um, more, more and more Chinese companies are doing a lot in this field. Um, yes, I think uh, this is very important for our bilateral relations. And this is more for self-reliance and sustainability. That means even if the company goes back, they still, the Ugandans will have benefited a lot from, the, from this training. So going, this is the beginning uh, of the training. And I appreciate because if you look at the people, they are, training here, the training scientists, like our engineers, our surveyors, and also the site managers. This is really, really good. And I would recommend that if other companies can also be able to do this when they leave, uh, when they come to do um, uh, business in Uganda, they should be able to leave.